In this video, we are going to download and install IntelliJ IDEA on Windows 11. The installation process is exactly the same on Windows 11 and also on Windows 10. Open your browser. I am using Google Chrome. You can use any browser that you like. Then type download IntelliJ IDEA Windows. The official website for IntelliJ IDEA is jetbrains.com. So click on the first link. We are downloading and installing it on Windows. Here you have three tabs Windows, Mac OS, and Linux. You have IntelliJ IDEA Ultimate and you have also the community the community edition is completely free but if you are using it for commercial or for enterprise for businesses it is best to use the ultimate version but it is not free if you see in the pricing for organizations the ultimate version is 599 dollar and all products pack is $779 for individual use the ultimate is $169 and all pack is $289 and it is also yearly billing but if you choose monthly it will be different Let us go and download the community edition. Click on download. Beautiful download completed. Go to your download folder. Double click on the installer file. The welcome page. Click on next. The installation location. Leave it as it is. And also about this space required 2.4 gigabyte and space available is this much just in case you don't have enough space on your drive you can change the location for example if you have uh, different drivers you can change that now by default it is on uh, drive c if you don't have enough space you can change it to drive d or something click on next Then the shortcut, check it, opt in the context menu and also add uh, to the path. For me, I only use Java, but if you are using Kotlin, then select also the dot .kt, dot .kts. If you are using IntelliJ IDEA for Android development, then also check Gradle or groovy so check the options you need when it is okay click on next now click on install I want to manually reboot later for now it is okay click on finish beautiful let us open IntelliJ IDEA double click on it
confirm the terms then click on continue data sharing it is not necessary to send import settings escape the import of the settings here you have projectors customize plugins and learn here you can customize the user interface like a light theme or dark theme and also the font size 14 16 13 or you can check sync with the ways let us create a test project new project test and java project you can change in the location test in java for example a folder here select it ok create git repository it is good to have so build system IntelliJ ID the JDK so here you have the registered JDK you can download it JDK stands for Java Development Kit in the previous video I showed how to install Java Development Kit on Windows 11 or Windows 10 the link is in the description you can watch it programs java jdk22 advanced settings module name content root module file location it's okay now click on create wait a little bit for the indexing very nice we do need this breakpoint let us run this code here you have the play icon very nice here you have the result hello and welcome here you have system.app.printf hello and welcome so this counting comes from this for loop system.app.println isi here it did not jump to the next line because it is print f if we change it to print ln it will come down save it and run again hello and welcome is one two three four and five beautiful you have successfully installed intellij idea in the community edition on your machine that's it guys i hope it was helpful thanks for watching liking sharing commenting and being around have great times and hopefully see you in the next video